this Dollar Tree. They usually don't put out the movies on time, but you never know. You least expect it. It's the stores that you don't think are gonna have the new stuff yet. What's going on? Look at all this new stuff they got in and this one that I don't go to. Look, my pile is growing. Thank you. I'm back again. I struck out the first time, but maybe this time they put it out. They should. Shut out again. Nothing. Aloha, New Eloa. Greetings, brand new subscribers, and welcome back, my Goy Hunter Ohana. Yay! Thank you very much for joining me in the second my second Dollar Tree hunt and haul. Yes. But before we begin that, I want to give a shout out to James DT Movie Movie Trading Empire. Yes, I always trade with James. So Hi, James. Let's see what we traded. This is from the April drop. So it's a little old, but still new. Yes. So I traded these two before I found them on my own. Riverworld and Hammer of the Gods. With a slipcover, yay. And then he had... Uh, Eloise, which I did not find at all. Dun, 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 dun. It's a vertical release. And Eliza Dushku is in it. And this one, I, I wanted to buy this at uh, Walmart when it came out first. After the death of her his father, Jacob Martin, must find his long-lost aunt if he is to inherit his family's fortune. J Jacob's search leads him to Eloise, a now defunct, in a now defunct insane asylum where his aunt was committed. Oh boy. Looks like it's a losing battle. Great one. Thank you, James. Then he also found this, which I didn't find. Historical Missions, HDR Net, Ward Report. Yay. There's a space shuttle. Well, one of them. Ward Report cameras have been, have had unique access to the mission of shuttle discovery. Yeah. So I didn't get that one. Then I got this from him. Romeo plus Juliet. Uh, this is with... Haley Stein, Steinfeld and Douglas Booth. Uh, this is a universal release. William Shakespeare's epic and searing love story has been revitalized for a whole new generation. So this is the star-crossed youths who fall for each other in spite of their family feuding. A new version, Romeo plus Juliet. Then Winnie... Winnie, uh, Jennifer Hudson, Terrence Howard. Here's the back. And this was a universal release. This is a Canadian release. And this is based on an in-depth, unbiased film would take the audience on a remarkable journey of understanding Winnie Mandela. Through her fierce determination and dauntless courage, her unconquerable spirit caught the attention of the world and earned her name the mother of the nation Winnie great one then tremors a day a cold day in hell I can add that to my tremors collection 
And this one is another universal release. And they find themselves up in ears. And they head to Canada to investigate a series of giant deadly worm attacks. Tremors. And last but not least, I was so happy that he found this. Hell on Wheels, the complete fourth season DVD. I started to watch this and then I stopped. I don't know why. Because I did enjoy it. This is the fourth season of the AMC's top rated drama, Hell Freezes Over. Following the brutal winter of 1868, the railroad is at a standstill. And restless workers wreak habit on Cheyenne. Oof. So this is all that I traded him stuff that I had in digital codes. And this is my trades from James DT Movie Trading Empire. Thank you, James. We'll probably trade for the June drop, too. Okay. So that we got that out of the way, let's dig in to the Dollar Tree second haul. Grab a snack, big old sandwich, hamburger, or this could be a vegetable if you're vegetarian. <sighs> you drink or sip it. Relax back in your chair and away we go. First one up. Clear the skies. It is a BBC video, 9-11 Air Defense. Here is the back. And this one, the very idea of the United States being attacked so unexpected on the morning of September 11th, um, dispersed among seven bases were responsible for the defense. Four alone responsible for the entire Northeast. At 944, an order was given that had never been attempted before to go to condition air traffic control zero to clear the skies of all non-military aircraft. Clear the skies. This looks very educational and interesting. Then I found this race to freedom, the Underground Railroad. This looks very moving. And three bonus movies. This, of course, is an Echo Bridge release. The three bonus movies are Honey Dripper, Stigma, Go Tell It to the Mountain. So the Underground Railroad, uh, it's the race to freedom, chronicles the dangerous journey of four determined slaves from a cotton plantation in America to the promised land in Canada. And then Honey Dripper stars Danny Glover. Uh, he would try anything to keep his blues lounge, the Honey Dripper, alive. Then Stigma is Philip Michael Thomas. Remember him on Miami Vice? He's invited to an island off the coast of Maine to visit one of his medical school professors and assist him with a secret project. Oh, boy. And the last one, Go Tell It to the Mountain. Uh, is about personal struggles of uh, James Baldwin's beloved novel. Vig Rhymes is in it. Wow. And um, CCH Pounders in this. This is a good, good copula compilation. Sorry about that. Excuse me. The Underground Room. The next one I found. I only found one of these, Intensive Care, Intensive Care. Here is the back. Uh, this one is a, let's see, screen media release. Three low-life criminals plan to rob an elderly woman, but her caregiver turns out to be a former special ops agent with an agenda of her own. Whoa. Talk about turning the tides, Intensive Care. The next one I found is for the kids, or for crazy people like me. It's called The Hive. Ten episodes as seen on Disney Junior, A Very Buzz Buzzby Christmas. So this airs on the Disney Junior channel. And here, that was the back. So, 
Welcome to Honey Bee High. Meet the bee family. Papa bee, mama bee, buzz bee, ruby, and baby. But um bum <laughs> uh, They are just like any other family except they are tiny, strappy, and buzz around in the sky. So there's 10 episodes in this, all relating to Christmas. And this is a Cynodig Hive Enterprise release. Then I also found another one, Biz, Busby's Family Adventures. There you go. Same family. Here's the back. And this one is regarding summer, I guess. And it's a Cynodig uh, Hive Enterprise release, the Hive. Then I found the Blu-ray of this, The Hero of Color City, Christina Ricci, Ricci, Craig Ferguson, Rosie Perez, Sean Austin, Wayne, Wayne Brady, Jessica Capshaw. This looks cute. Dun, da, da, da. Beautiful slipcover and in a yellow case. So that made it even better. It is a Dove approved. And each night when Ben falls asleep, his crayons enter a magical crayon box that transports them to Color City, a world of dazzling hues and soaring fantasy. Wow, that's cool. It's a Magnolia release. Oh, yes it is. Woo, double whammy. And then I found this. I found this earlier at a Goodwill, but now I found it. Fresh factory sealed. Quick pro quo. Quid pro quo. Quid pro quo. Oh boy. Nick Star. Oh, my favorite. Vera Fer. Oh boy. Ferigma. Oh. Ferigma. I had it. I was practicing it all before this video. Now I can't say it. You know, she plays. Um, Oh, uh, the Conjuring, the Warrens, one of the, the wife. Oh boy, I'm really having senior moments right now. Here is the back. This is a strange new American dream. It's very erotic. Uh, it's a Magnolia release, and I covered this before, so I'm not going to talk about it again. Uh, but it's an interesting concept, yes. Then I found this beauty. Kill Me Three Times with Voodoo Code in a beautiful, beautiful slipcover. Nice and foily. So, everyone, uh, this was a re prior release, but it was a uh, Blu-ray. So, this is a Magnolia. Yay! Kill Me Three Times is, is a darkly comedic thriller from Rising Star director... Criv Stenders. Simon Pegg plays the cunning assassin. Charlie Wolf, who discovers he isn't the only person trying to kill the temptress of a sun-drenched surfing town. Interesting premise. Let's see. Teresa Palmer, Luke Hemsworth, Brian Brown. Kill me three times. Then I was very surprised to find this. Get Shorty. It was so random. I only found this once out of all the stories I covered. John Travolta, Gene Hackman, Rene Russo, Danny DeVito. Here's the backup. And this is a 20th Century Fox release. Drug smuggling, racketeering, loan sharking, welcome to Hollywood. John Travolta leads an on-star cast in this hysterical comedy that insists it doesn't take much to make it in the movies. Just a background with the mob. Ha ha ha. Yeah, right. Get shorty. Get shorty. Then I also found this baby. Another Blu-ray. The right kind of wrong. Leo just met the love of his life at her wedding. Oh, another rom-com. Looks kind of cute, though. This is a Magnolia release. Here is the back. Wow, there's a lot of Magnolia stuff this time. Uh, Leo is a failed writer-turned-dishwasher made famous 
for many flaws and shortcomings in his blog called Why You Suck. A huge internet success written by his ex-wife. Then Leo meets um, Colette, the girl of his dreams, on the day she's marrying the perfect man. Oh boy. I hope he doesn't go chasing after her. I think he is. That's the whole premise, right? The right kind of wrong. Then I found Soldiers of Change. A word apart, a long-lasting love. Is it a drama? It's an Echo Bridge release. Here is the back. And plunge into the turbulent times of the 60s civil rights movement and Vietnam. A wealthy Southern white boy, Randy, and the niece, Hallie, of his black servant meet at the age of 13. Their friendship grows over the years into an endless love that defies all the evils of prejudice and war. Oh, Ben Vereen and Deborah Allen is also, Debbie Allen also starring in this. Oh, it sounds touching. Soldiers of Change. It looks like it has a sad ending, though. Next one I found, Paranoia Collection. Nine features. I only found this once. It's an Echo Bridge release. Here is the back. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to read them all off to you. Forever Mine, uh, The Little Shop of Horrors, Memory, Jekyll and Hyde, The Legend of Sorrow Creek, Seven Nights of Darkness, Empty Rooms, Descent, 976 Evil 2. So that's a lot of paranoia, move, paranormal movies for you. Ooh, I only found this one once too. Teeth and Blood. Death is just the beginning. Oh, I have it backwards. Sorry. I was excited when I saw this because of the slipcover. It's a RLJ release entertainment. Dun, dun, dun. Ooh. Oops, I didn't take the sticker off. Sorry, folks. Um, <clears throat> so a beautiful diva is murdered on the set of a horror direct director, Vincent Augustine's latest movie, Chapel Blood. Somewhere between the crime scene and the coroner's van, the body mysteriously disappears. Meanwhile, the city's supply of donated blood is being dangerously depleted. Uh-oh. Is there a correlation? Teeth and blood. Excited. Exciting. I love vampire. Then I found this oldie but goodie in a snapper case. Colin Farrell, Scott Can, Oh, Con, sorry, that's James Con's son. American Outlaws, This Much Fun, Can't Be Legal. Snapper case there. Isn't it? I, I think it's so odd. Sometimes the Dollar Tree um, gets these old, old movies and snapper cases. Two, cor two corrupt railroad barons. Oh, no. Oh, boy, folks. Um, take a bite of your sandwich or a sip of your coffee. Let's see. I'm going to try again get the sticker off. Jesse Cole and their rough and ready gang ride to the rescue of farmers terrorized by a railroad land grab scheme in American Outlaws. A dust and thunder update of Western lore. Huh. This is a very young Colin Farrell. American Outlaws. Woohoo! Now this one caught my eye. Another shark movie. Shark Island with Yancey Butler. Yee! Seven Days, Seven Sharks, One Survivor. Here is the back. And this one is an Asylum release. A group of complete strangers find themselves isolated by a wealthy madman on his island compound. They are forced into a horrifying gauntlet where they must survive a barrage of ever deadlier species of sharks. Wow. 2012. Looks nice. I like the cover. Shark Island. 
Now this finally made it to the West Coast, finally, or maybe finally to the Dollar Trees around me. High Rise. Excited to find this. It's a Magnolia release. Here is the back. Tom, I thought it was Huddleston. Luke Evans is in it, Jeremy Irons, Elizabeth Moss. Look at that beautiful slipcover. An apocalyptic romp. Let's see what it says. A Dr. Robert Lang, the newest resident of a luxurious apartment in a high-tech skyscraper whose lofty location places him among society's upper class. Uh, Lang quickly settles in, meets the other tenants. And then what happens? Let's see. Uh, the power... Uh, uh, Huh? There's a class war. I guess something happens and then the different classes of people go to bickering war. High rise. Interesting concept, is it? I found this nice movie. Uh, it's The Coalition, inspired by actual events. It's another Magnolia release. Here is the back. And it says, there's more than one player in the game. Dating a professional athlete opens up an A-list whirlwind of VIP nightclubs, charity galas, upscale spas, and lavish gifts. But it can also lead to a world of deception, cheating, and heartache. A group of women form an unlikely alliance to get revenge on a superstar baller and his friends for playing them. Oh, boy. Is this a drama or a comedy? I think it's a drama. They don't look like they're joking. The Coalition. Girl's Revenge. Now I found the Blu-ray version. In Dubious Battle, the James Franco film. Um, the Giants, John Steinbeck adaptation, which he directed. I already covered this because we found the DVD. So the Blu-rays out there too. Yay. Ooh, I found another Monster High. Frights camera action. To add to the collection, Monster High collection. Here is the back. And this is Roll Out the Black Carpet. Uh, when Draculaura is led to believe she's the rightful heir to the vampire throne, she and her best ghoul friends are whisked away to Transylvania for a royal coronation to die for. But they soon discover the hunt for the queen is not over yet. The ghouls must locate an ancient artifact known as a vampire's heart in order to discover the identity of the true vampire queen. Wow. That's a detailed description. Uh, I saw a lot of people find this. And I was lucky to find it too. Permanent. Permanent. Uh, Rain Wilson. Patricia Arquette. Hairstyles of temporary. Family is forever. Here is the back. Yay! I took the sticker off. This is a Magnolia release. Look at that gorgeous, gorgeous slip cover. Ooh, this looks very funny. Let's see. Set in 1982 in a small town, Virginia permanent centers around the newly relocated Dixon family. Uh, in this hilariously awkward and unique story full of wit and wisdom of a hairstyle gone wrong, hairstyle gone wrong, the Dixons are struggling through major life changes Together all the while while trying desperately to emerge intact on the other side. Huh. Interesting. I don't get it. I guess I gotta watch it. Ooh. Another Blu-ray. Now, I picked this up because I, this is a different cover than when it was released before on the Dollar Tree. Killing Season. John Travolta. Robert De Niro. Oh, I didn't grab the other slipcover. I'm sorry. Here is the back. 
this is a Millennium Echo Bridge release. But originally it was, let's see, it doesn't say. Former American soldier Benjamin Ford is a man whose soul is in traction from devastating memories of the um, of war. When a mysterious man offers to help him with his broken down car, the two become fast friends. Little does he know this man, a former Serbian soldier, whom Ford thought he had killed in the war. Ooh. Oh, boy. Is he chasing him? The killing season. Oh, yes. Everyone found this one. But I'm just happy to find it, too. Vanishing on 7th Street. Stay in the light. There's a DVD in digital code. It's a magnet release. Hayden Christensen... Tandy Newton and John Leguizamo. Here is the back. I already have the Blu-ray of this, so now I can add this DVD version. Gorgeous, gorgeous slipcover. The slipcover alone is worth a dollar. Now this I watched twice because the first time I watched it, I wasn't happy. The second time I watched it, at least I knew what to expect. Because I don't think the ending was very fulfilling for me. But let me just read the back for you. So, Vanishing on 7th Street taps into one of humankind's most primal anxieties, fear of the dark. An unexplained blackout plunges the city of Detroit into total darkness. And the few remaining people, uh, they all somehow meet up at this bar. And... Um, those are the few survivors. But they have to survive the darkness because somehow the darkness kills people or takes their soul or they just disappear. But you need to watch this yourself and come to your own conclusions. Vanishing on 7th Street. Ooh, I was happy to find this. Steak Hot, Steakland 2. I love Steakland 1. Steakland 2. Death is no escape. Here's the back. And this is a, a Raven Banner releasing and Dark Sky Films collab. When his home in New Eden is destroyed by a revitalized brotherhood and its new vamp leader, Martin finds himself alone in the badlands of America with only the distant memory of his mentor, the legendary vampire hunter, Mr. to guide him. Roaming the wilderness, of a steadily decaying country, Martin searches for the one man who can help him exact revenge. Interesting. Who stars in this? I forget. Let's see. Uh, oh, nothing. Nobody that we know. Stakeland T. I love those uh, apocalyptic stuff movies. Oh, this beautiful. This beautiful movie I found. We already found the Blu-ray last haul. But now we have the DVD. The Eyes of My Mother. Magnet release. Look at this beautiful, pristine slipcover. Wow. Ooh, I'm so excited to find it and make sure it's in 100% great condition. So... Um, why am I going to read this? Because I already covered this in the last one. Well, the last haul. In April. Beautiful. Hands down, one of the best horror movies of the year. Wow. Okay. Oh, this is uh, one of my favorite movies. I, this is a sleeper. You guys got to watch it. But this has been released on DVD and on Blu-ray a long, long time ago, but it's back again. Sushi Girl. Sushi Girl. Tony Todd, Andy McKenzie, and Mark Hamill. Revenge is the best dish served raw. Here is the back. Uh, this was a magnet release. So this is such an interesting film. So one of these guys comes out of prison, and then the head guy... I guess they're in a quote-unquote gang. And the head gentleman decides to throw a banquet for him coming out of prison. 
but there's so much involved. Little plot lines beside the main plot line. Gotta watch it. Sushi Girl, a sleeper. Enjoyable. Then I was lucky to find this. The Guard of Ostwist. Based on true events. This is an Echo Bridge SP release. Okay. This Holocaust tale takes Hans an aspiring. Oh no. And this, hold on, folks. Sometimes I take the stickers off, sometimes I don't. Oh boy. Oh, it does. Okay. An, inspi an inspiring artist. Since childhood, who becomes a talented architect, he raises. He rises from the Hitler Youth to the SS with dreams of leading Germany into a bright new age. When he is assigned to Auschwitz, he completely believes in the cause. But when his superiors ask him to use his architect skills to design and oversee construction of the notorious gas chambers, his perspective changes. Ooh. Wow. Ooh, these these movies really get to me. I'm speechless. Oh! So we found the Blu-ray version. I bought it from Hamilton Book. Now the DVD version for a dollar. You might be the killer. I found this in a couple of Dollar Trees. So I'm not going to read it since I already covered this in the uh, in a Hamilton Book Hall. Check the prior Hamilton Book Hall if you want to know what that movie's about. And last but not least, beyond from the producers of Co Company of Wars, of Heroes, Beyond Valkyrie, Dawn of the Dawn of the Fourth Rank. Oh man, I don't know what's wrong with me. I, I, something's wrong with my tongue today. Sean, oh, I've been sucking on those lollipops still. Sean Patrick Flannery, Tom Sizemore. Stephen Lang, Rutger, Rutger Howard? Ooh, that's a treat. Here's the back. Third, the fourth rank. Let's see. It is an immense thriller from the front lines of the World War II. As Operation Valkyrie prepares to assassinate Adolf Hitler, an allied, an allied special ops team prepares to extract the men des, um, destined to lead post-war Germany. But after Valkyrie fails, everything changes. Oh boy. Wow, I'm going to watch this one for sure. It's a Sony release. Big time. Big time. Whew. Okay, folks. That is the end of the 2nd. June 11th, 2021. Drop. Oh, let's see. I'm forgetting something. We covered James. We covered... Th I know what I'm not forgetting. No. Yes. The giveaway. Hold on, folks. Let me get it. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, folks. I'm going to say this group of movies is a little weird. I wanted to put together all different types this time. And the digital code included in this giveaway is Monster Hunter. Monster Hunter. Uh, the new release film. The one that everyone's... They're not too happy about it because it's based on a video game. The gamers don't like it because it's not like the game. Because it's a movie! People don't realize you have to stuff the entire video game into one one hour and 45 minutes to two hours in a script. That's pretty hard. But I love the special effects. Mila is in this. Yay. And Tony Jaw. Okay. Let's put it there. And then we have for the Blu-rays, Gringo. Gwen with slipcover, and I took the sticker out for you. 
from my collection to you, Crank Original One. Well, I don't know if it's a re re release or the original. It looks like the original. Ooh, Sicario, the first one with Emily Blunt. Wow, this is a good one. All factory sealed. Here's the five DVDs, all factory sealed also. Dwelling, right there. Can you see it? Yeah. End of the World, three movies. God Bless America. Uh, the Blu-ray was released in the June, June drop. A Serious Man, Coen Brothers film. And this old machine. So, like I said, it's a very interesting mixture of films in this giveaway. Very easy. This is going to be, the password is going to be monster. Yes, monster. M-O-N-S-T-E-R. Here is the goodies. And if you're interested in participating in the giveaway, it's so easy. First, you must be a subscriber to my channel, which is the channel you're watching right now. You must reside in the United States because I mail it out to you. I pay for the postage. You don't have to worry about it. And then you must watch the end. The winner is Monster Giveaway. Um, once you watch that, you'll see if you were the lucky winner. The random, random comment picker does all the work for us. Yes. So that was the giveaway. Again, the password is monster monster so folks we're getting closer to our goal of 805 subscribers and once I hit that 805 I will reward everyone with that giveaway a $40 Best Buy gift card pretend that's the gift card $40 gift card to Dollar Tree and then a whole box of about 30 to 25 DVDs and Blu-rays. Yeah, I still didn't get it yet. But just, don't worry, I'm good for it. You can ask the other subscribers who won the, the, big, the big giveaways once I hit the, the um, what do you, I don't know how to say that. The, oh, never mind. You know what I'm talking about. Okay, folks, that's it. Again, thank you so much for watching my vid. I know you have a big choice out there. There's so many other people showing their Dollar Tree on, but I'm thanking you for watching me. And I'm also thanking you in advance for liking the video. Yes, like, 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 like. Subscribe. Subscribe to the Goy Hunter. And tell others to subscribe. Please, comment below. Join the contest. Join the contest. Put monster in there. You don't have to write a sentence. Just put monster. Share. Share the Goy Hunter. Share. Share me with everyone. Your barber, the grocery store, clerks, your family, anyone you talk to. Tell them to watch me, please. And, of course, that was a good one. Smash that notification. Ding-a-ling-a-ling. Ding-a-ling-a-ling-a-ling-a-ling. -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling -a -ling bell. So you always know when the latest video is uploaded and ready for you to watch. Yep. Again, thank you so much for joining me. Everyone be safe out there. Goy Hunter out. Arrivederci. Ciao. Avida Zain. Mahalo Nui Loa. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. Spread that love. Spread that Goy Hunter love. Yes, please do. And the Blu ray Bandit is wishing everyone a nice, healthy, and safe rest of the day, 
evening, morning, whatever time it is that you're watching this. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.